Acá estamos en el SEMA Show, como todos los años, eh, buscando nuevas oportunidades para nuestro mercado. Ahora estamos hablando con la gente de Red Horse, que es una empresa que estamos trabajando hace muchos años y está dando muy buenos resultados en Argentina, sobre todo en la parte de, de competición, que es nuestro rubro. ¿Cómo llegaste a esta empresa Red Horse? Eh, bueno, indagando obviamente y viniendo todos los años, uno siempre va viendo nuevas empresas y la verdad que luego de probar el producto y obviamente sentir el apoyo de la marca, eh, nos decidimos obviamente a distribuirla a nuestro país. ¿Cómo es la relación con ASAP Trading? Bueno, con ASAP Trading, en, con JJ, Juan y con Ricardo, tenemos una muy buena relación que fuimos obviamente forjando a través de los años. Y bueno, él es como un eslabón muy importante entre la conexión en las fábricas de Estados Unidos y nosotros, que estamos en Sudamérica, ya que traslada nuestras necesidades y obviamente vela por ellas. ¿no? Y la idea este año es eh, juntarnos con diversos importadores de Latinoamérica, obviamente la idea fue de Juan, eh, y de esa manera ejercer por ahí una fuerza mayor ante las diversas fábricas para, digamos, para poder conseguir mayores beneficios para todos. ¿no? So Red Horse Performance, uh, we specialize with uh, fuel fittings, uh, fuel line, transmission lines, things of that nature, plumbing, uh, also do fuel filters, regulators, um, different fuel system stuff. Uh, we have Martin, TRC, and down in Argentina, we already established distrib distributor, and we also have a partnership with ASAP Trading and just looking for uh, new business in, in Latin America and continue the partnership all the way around. So Red Horse started a little over 10 years ago, and our first entry to the market was the hand-polished hose end. And so what we do is all these different components are individually hand-polished on jewelry polishing machines before they're anodized. So this is a clear anodized, and you can really see the polish. It's like a mirror. Uh, and we did this, we launched the product around 11 years ago. Uh, we only had about 600 part numbers, which is very small for a fitting line. Uh, but immediately people saw this product and they wanted to get on their engines and then slowly but surely since then we've been growing the line. So we're up to around 2,800 SKUs. Uh, we're getting away from just the hose ends and the adapters. We're starting to do some more fuel system components and things like that. Uh, we're doing regulators, fuel pumps, fuel filters. Um, and we're looking you know, to kind of keep broadening out the range of products that we're offering, offering creative solutions for any plumbing needs that a customer might have. Yeah, so we're a company that very much uh, believes in distribution. So in the U.S., we sell mostly through two-step traditional distribution, you know, still selling to distributors who are selling to the shops, who are selling to the end users. Uh, and we want to replicate that in Latin America, find some great distributors who can get the word out there. We focus on making a good product, uh, and we need our distributors to help us market and get the product to the racers in all the markets, including Latin America.